Hi, it's Carl here from StorageCraft. Today I'm just doing a quick update on the latest version of Image Manager 756. This was released in March 2018, um, and I've just installed the update now. One of the, the cool features here I just wanted to point out to um, our partner base is that when you select a managed folder um, where it lists the images, we now have a new feature where you can right click. So from here we can immediately perform a verification of the image or we can verify the whole chain based on the shortest path of the backup chain. We can also pull uh, information on the shortest path of the backup chain. So I can see here this image is uh, 3,129. That's how many backups have been done. Um, so if I click view chain shortest path, it will look through the consolidated images. Uh, at the bottom is the, the backup that I had selected. Uh, and we can see there it goes through a couple of intra-daily backups that Shadow Protect have done. There's uh, last night's consolidated daily backup through uh, various consolidated weeklies up through the monthly to the backup chain. So the cool thing with this is we can see here there's you know maybe um, two handfuls of images even though there's been over 3,000 backups done. We've even got a button here to remove all images not in the shortest path. So I guess if you've got, um, if you're running out of storage, this is a quick way to say, look, I'm not too worried about my existing retention policy. Please just delete all the images that aren't part of the shortest path. Just note that obviously I selected the C volume, so um, there's a separate chain obviously for the recovery partition on this instance. So each volume um, you would want to run through that same uh, process. We also have a separate option to review redundant images. So this is going to show you uh, images that are in this backup chain for this partition um, that are redundant or, or not required as part of that shortest path of the chain. So we have uh, an option here to go and just simply remove them straight away to, and that's all images uh, in that managed folder relating to that volume. So these are nice, quick, easily accessible options. Um, verify, as I mentioned, is just going to verify that one image. Um, it's obviously going to do an MD5 verification if uh, the MD5 was not there, it would use Image Manager's CRC verification. But very quick way um, to see exactly what's going on. Uh, and obviously that's handled as part of the verification process here. Um, if I go and kick off that again, uh, and this time I click Verify Chain, um, we will see here under verification that it's going to go through. And you can see there it's starting at the base image and it's gonna go and work its way through that whole chain back through to that last image. So very cool, just thought I'd do a quick uh, YouTube to point this out. Thanks.